Hey guys, John Jackson here with Pro H Paintball. I am back with another weekly video. Today I'm pretty excited. Um, this isn't a new product, but it's a new colorway and I, I think it looks great. So today I have the Exalt, the uh, family of cases. So we have the Exalt tank case. We have the Exalt goggle case. We have the loader case. And of course we have the lens case. Um, these may look the same to you uh, if you've seen the gray ones we've had before, but a little bit different. And this is probably my favorite part is I'm a big color guy. Like I'm always love red, black and red, stuff like that. But today we got the cases in and blue and a good color blue, not like some dark blue or some lame blue, real nice blue. So I'm just gonna go over, show you what they look like. Um, don't click away from the video yet. If you don't mind to watch it through and just give it a quick rundown. I have something in each one of these to show you what kind of lens it holds, what size it holds. So if you're curious, if your air tank or your hopper or your mask will fit, uh, I'm gonna go over that here in a second. So this is an HK 80 cubic inch bottle that I have inside this here. I don't know if a Ninja 90 would fit. <clears throat> it seems like it would be pretty close to the end of it. Um, but I know for sure an 80, like an Empire 80, HK Army 80, or like a Ninja 77 will definitely fit in here. So if you've never seen a Exalt tank cover for tank case, it does have Velcro in here. So that way your tank's not gonna fall out. And then also treat it like Dairy Queen. What's up? There we go, so it stays in there. It also has a little elastic piece in the front here. So if you wanna take your rag off when you're traveling and put it in here, you can, it has a little spot, you can do that. It's like a microfiber finish on the inside, so it's not gonna scratch your stuff up. And there's a little bit more room in here, so you can fit you know, a microfiber or anything else like that. You got a little room in there. Pretty nice little zipper. Never really had any issues with these. And then these also have a carrying handle. So if you're gonna to go to the local field, you wanna get air you know, filled up and you wanna just carry your bottle so it rolls off the table and falls on the ground, you can carry it, nice little carrying handle there. So you're good to go. And these are about $25, $30. Good to go, so that is a tank case. This is gonna be your lens case. So this is the V3. So they have released different versions over the years. This one's nice, it's got a little pocket up top. It's got a hard pocket in here. So anything you put inside of here isn't gonna damage like the lens that you put inside of it. So if you can put Allen keys, your actual keys, um, anything like that in the top part, it's not gonna get scratched up, or sorry, it's not gonna scratch up the lens that's inside of it. Same thing, microfiber there, and the blue. Right now, inside of here, I have the, I have an Events or Vents lens, so it's a pretty big lens system, as you can tell. Um, you can also fit up to an EVS lens system in here. I've used to have one of these in my Empire EVS, um, and you can fit an EVS lens in here as well. It does have little cloths that are sewn, or Velcroed, sorry, inside of here, so that way you can actually separate your lenses. So on the very first version, they didn't have these. They had just had little pieces of cloth. Um, everybody would lose them immediately. And then you didn't have anything to separate your lenses anymore. So again, it is that microfiber finish on the inside of it, or terry cloth, I guess more. Put it in there, use the cloth to separate it. And then you can put another lens behind it and then another lens behind that if you'd like. And then just close it up. So like I said, this is a Vince lens. Uh, EVS lens will fit in this. I think those are the biggest lenses that are currently available. This is gonna be your loader case. These are available. Uh, we do have them in a, in a red, of course. And then of course their standard is like a, a carbon fiber color with a lime green. We have those as well in stock. You have your blue. Of course I did a Spire 4. Um, of course everybody likes the way these look. So the way it's designed here, it's got a place for the feed neck all the little rip drives, uh, anti-jam things, that little slot there. And also has a place for four AA batteries. And so that way you can put a nine volt battery into this spot. They're not individual compartments. It's kind of cool, it comes out. So you can put a nine volt battery, two nine volts in here if you wanted to, or two double A's. And that just slides in there so you can wash it and clean it. Your loader goes into here, close it up. What's cool too is inside the top part has a Velcro pocket. So if you wanted to put your lid, so if you have a speed feed on your loader, um, for example, like the Spire or the Die R2 has a lid system that, or a, a speed feed that pops off real easy. Uh, you can actually put that inside of here or extra batteries, anything like that, tools inside the top part. And that just zips up. Good to go. And last but not least, we have the goggle case. This is probably the most popular. <coughs> this is probably the most popular case that we do carry and that we do sell the most of because everybody has a paintball mask. 
uh, that they want to protect. Most masks nowadays are going to be about $150 to $200 for the really high-end ones. So you definitely want to make sure you protect that. So you've got the zipper here on the outside. It's got the cloth on the inside. This is a little different, so it's a pretty large pocket, um, and it does move around. So it's like not a not as stiff or hard like the lens case. And so that way you can fit you can fit your iPhone in here, your wallet at the end of the day, your keys in here. Um, Sometimes if you're at the local field, this is a good place to throw your stuff in so you don't forget where it's at and it doesn't get lost in your gear bag. So you can throw it all in here. Good to go there. And then got the whole zipper, pull it out. This is an EBS goggle. I tried finding the largest mask that we carry as far as physical size goes. Um, and it is a snug fit, but it fits perfect inside here. As you see on the top there, it doesn't hang over. It closed no problem. It is ventilated. You can't really see this in the video, but this part here is actually ventilated. So if you're playing and you get all sweat, you know, sweaty, hot and everything like that, there will be some air ventilation inside to basically dry out your mask. <clears throat> and you're good to go. Let's get that back up. So uh, the lens case and the goggle case, I believe, are the only two that come with a, like a carabiner. So if you want to attach this like to your backpack, I've seen a lot of players in local field uh, you know, they're gonna, or to go to a tournament, they're gonna walk the field, they put this on their backpack so they can go walk the field or go test their gun if they got their mask. Also the lens case and the tank case, so you don't drop anything, they do come with uh, the carrying handle, so I like that a lot. So these are available currently on our website, prohspb.com. Uh, you can go to, I believe it's accessories and upgrades and go down to hard cases. We have all the Exalt branded uh, cases, all the HK cases, uh, I think that's everybody. Inception, I think, makes a couple that we have as well. Um, but I am excited. We do got we do have the uh, blue ones now in stock. The gray with blue. Again, we have black with red or gray with red and uh, the black with lime. So if you guys have any questions about any of this product or anything else that you can think of, uh, definitely always open to different video ideas. Just go and comment below. If you like the video, please take a second and like the video. Actually, click on it, please. And if you like to watch paintball videos, we do at least two videos every week, every Tuesday and Thursday. Tuesday is like a tech video, shows you how to do something, install something, clean something, or repair something. Um, and then Thursday is gonna be like a product review video, a shooting video, a new product release, or anything like that. And then Friday's occasion, we'll do uh, pro tip videos. So we're trying to do a few more videos here and there. Uh, try to spice up the YouTube channel, help it grow. So thank you guys so much for watching. As always, subscribe, like this video. If you have any questions or just wanna say hey, just give it, go ahead and comment below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Before you go, if you liked our videos, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel. You can subscribe right here, or you can watch other videos right here and right here. Also, we give away free Pro Age paintball stickers on our website, prohspb.com, or you can click the link in the description. And as always, any of the products you saw in the video are available for sale on our website, prohspb.com. We'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.